Hi, I'm Jan Fabian Wallach, and I have another watercolor painting tip of the day for you. I love to paint pine trees and, and woods scenes, landscapes, and there are so many great ways to paint pine trees. I like to use a variety when I'm painting a forest. So today I want to show you uh, a technique that I use for background pine trees, sometimes, a lot of times, winter trees. This just involves an, a scrap piece of uh, mat board and an X-Acto knife. So you want to be a little careful. I'm, I'm just scoring in to a mat board, straight down a trunk of a tree, and then I, with curved arcs, I'm cutting into the mat board. And you can see the paper starting to pick up. Actually, that's what I want. I want that to just be very rough and scored. All right, when I get that done, brush it off and use a brush loaded with paint. Come back over and paint the pine tree. Just add paint. You don't have to be real careful about how you do it. In fact, I think it's a little better if you're not because it's going to pick up some of the paint and leave some of the paint. Let's see what we've got. I'll take a, <laughs> I'll take an old piece of uh, scrap paper because I always want to test this before I try it on the paper. Let's press it down and I've got a great image of a pine tree. I can use that same one again. I'll get a different image because there's not quite as much paint that's a pretty good image of a pine tree. It kind of looks like it has snow on it. Here's a painting that I did using that technique. And I think you can see the variety of, of pine trees in the background. Adds a lot of uh, interest. I hope you try this technique. Enjoy painting. If you want to see other tips and techniques with watercolor painting used in step-by-step how-to videos, go online to artistsnetwork.tv in the search box